in the way, get stepped on. In the race to the throne with a vest on. Trying to make you awake, not the best song. This is Look. the moment you waited for. And you know when they can't ignore it. From a city outside of it, copy your. But we all resided in Illinois. I can tell you some stories to keep them going. Outside it's a war, I already know. Early notice to my new opponents. This an easy win, nigga. God chose. It's like this, as I look around in this space. You remind you of your job as an artist, as a rapper. You know what I mean? It's like your goal at the end of whatever you're doing, your projects, your releases, and plays, and streams, just to get these plaques, man. You know what I mean? Like, LeBron James' job in the NBA is to get a ring. I don't care how good he is throughout the year, his job is to come home with that jury, man. So as we sit here at 93.1 radio station lobby, and all these guitars, all these plaques, all these artists up. And no malice in my words at all, but they ain't no better than me. You know what I'm saying? It's like, but they did their job. That's the difference. You know? So. This is phase one of the job. Started to finish the goal every time. That's how we come. Ain't no denying. Real the season. They know the vibes. Created a way. Now they paying for mine. Cut out the guests. Play by design. Hard to be humble when I know they lying. You playing it. Madtop 93 One Jams. Local love with your boy DJ Fusion. Violator All Star DJs. Got my man one of many in the building today. What's going on, fam? What's up? What's up, man? Thanks for having me. Man, it's a new year. We got some new music, some new vibes. Uh, what's what's going on over here? Man, it is, man. We the way. Uh, working on a new project. That's the title. We the way. Um, we just released a, a new uh, single. It's titled With Us. Um, and it's just really a representation of everybody that's with us. Um, right. So new single with us. Uh, what's it about? Uh, just everybody that's with us, man. We uh, over uh, 2021. We uh, celebrated in uh, coming together. Um, organization called It's a Us Thing, and it was just basically like an extension of that, like a song to the It's a Us Thing organization for June 10th that we Okay. Um, a bunch of uh, for-profit, I will uh, emphasize that, a bunch of for-profit businesses uh, came together to basically create uh, a modern way to celebrate June 10th. All right, that's and, what's and up. was just highlighting um, the people that signed up to be, you know, a part of that. Um, and I just made the theme song for it, you know, um, it's not limited to people that like the song and they wasn't on the banners or at the event, they can't rock it, you can, it's just more like a theme song to create uh, for your circle that's with you. So 2022, new album dropping, what's the time frame on that, when's it coming out? Yeah, so like I will say about like March, um, but you know, I work with QRK Skittles and uh, her project is uh, set to drop in April. Uh, so I'm gonna say about about March. But my main focus right now is just dropping uh, singles, releases, shooting videos, giving content. Uh, just drop uh, "Love Is Love" before we drop the song with us. Uh, so all these songs are uh, we drop the songs with the visuals as well. So not just the audio. So you can get them on YouTube, anywhere Spotify that you love music. You can watch it, see it, play it on SoundCloud, however you love it. Um, but that's what we're trying to do. For so I'm gonna say we're gonna drop the uh, title of the uh, record, which is uh, "We The Way." We drop the record. Uh, I ain't gonna give it an official date, but it'll be sometime in March. Man, that's work lifestyle. Uh, it, it's a lifestyle, it's a business, it's it's just a whole hub right now. That's a fact, that's a fact. Um, it's a uh, history in the making, we will say. Um, let's work is a, it's a mindset first, right? Um, mm -hmm. When you have multiple hands, multiple bodies, multiple uh, resources under, I guess, one name, one brand, one roof, it's literally less work. Absolutely, and, and you've kind of embraced that all around and, and what you offer isn't just it isn't just business it's 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 culture uh, it's community and, and it's really building so i wanted to really really highlight what work less lifestyle is up to here in madtown uh what got you guys started and and what it is that was your offering to the community because i think you know in the long run if more people knew about it more people would utilize it and a lot more people would be working less and living that lifestyle that's a fact um to be honest it all started with um just like some tr trendy trendy Twitter lingo, right? Okay. Uh, my favorite artist is Nipsey Hussle. All and right. he would reach out to like other um, industry artists to like work with him. He would use that type of spelling, less work. I knew he, I knew he meant less work together, right? But yep. he would spell it with the S. And I was Absolutely. just like, that's pretty slick, you know what I'm saying? So we just would interchange it in conversation, less work. It turned into like a t-shirt idea then. So okay. then we looked at like, where, where, where are we in the, the space of business? Right, and we was looking at Madison. It's like, where is hip hop in Madison? Where do we stand? Where do we sit? What can less work represent here? And we just knew it was a stigma in hip hop. So it's like, if you do hip hop, you rap here in, in the city of Madison. It was more about like um, shutting doors down or just making it seem like you really wasn't up to par. So the, how could we control the, our narrative and offer a solution that's professional, right? And still do and rewrite what we the do, narrative, right? 
So less work in turn, it means less emphasize self-service with optimistic resourceful knowledge. Right. So when you, again, work with a bunch of hands, you're going to do less work because I don't have to run the camera. I don't have to run the social. I, right. I don't have to make the beat. Right. It's, it's all of us. We all represent the same end goal, but it's less work because we do it together. Uh, and we, we started out of, I won't say necessity, survival. Right. Um, right. OK. It's, it's not like it's a, um, a, I would say, an open platform for you to just come in and be expressive. It's just more about like it hasn't been templated yet. Right, so we working on the template. We behind the scenes. It's more about like giving people hope that there is a way to sustain a local lifestyle. Absolutely. Right. And I think that that absolutely is is what you're embracing. I mean, you you have the clothing line, and you know it's kind of like what you started with, but you you branched off mm -hmm. into I guess what would you call it a communal yeah. outreach space, a shared yeah. like you took the concept of a shared office space, mm -hmm. but you made it urban and and brought it into the hip hop culture. Hip hop meets Netflix. Yeah, that's what we are working on right now. Uh, the new business models is offer way more value for a lower price, mm -hmm. right? So if you go to Planet Fitness, if you got a Netflix account, you understand what I'm talking about. Um, to break it down, Planet Fitness charges ten twenty dollars every thirty days, mm -hmm. but you can go anytime you want. Uh, workout, there's so many things in there you can utilize. It's like, yeah. dang, how can y'all keep y'all doors open? And then Netflix, they give you unlimited access. They basically kicked out the bootleg dude who used to sell us our yep. movies, and then they put them on Netflix. It was paid them all ten bucks a month. Ten bucks a month. It cost them one DVD. And you can sit in the house all day and yep. watch whatever you want. That's value. So if we don't understand what the new business models are, we gonna sink. You know what I mean? And these are the companies that swim, and they're not coming out saying, "Hey, do it like this from A to Z." You gotta just be able to peep the plate and then make your adjustment. Absolutely. So that's work. Our long term goal is to. Like I said, Netflix, the music industry, in a way where we alleviate upfront costs for artists. As a local artist, I know the pain points, right? It's the studio. It's, it's, it's huge. It's video it's huge costs. It's, it's really about your overhead. So mm -hmm. we can offer these solutions and put them under one roof, which is that's what our position or our path, that's what we've been leading towards over the, over the time we've been less work. That's where I think Madison, the, all the local communities that do music and entertainment is going to shift to. You're going to have to have a subscription that you offer every 30 days, and the value has to be way more than the price. Right, and, and at Less Work Lifestyle, the subscription comes in studio space, entrepreneurial guidance, mm -hmm. uh, and like-minded individuals that are trying to get on the same path. But what I think, and, and, and you can elaborate on it, but I think what really sets you apart from all these other people is, is you're not out here trying to be a label. You're not out here trying to sign somebody. Mm -hmm. You're out here trying to build a community of shared resources because being a small business owner, being an entrepreneur, and being an artist is is it's crazy expensive. It's crazy hard, mm -hmm. and you're on your own. Mm -hmm. Like you're really backed into a corner on your own out there. We play with a handicap, uh, but it's to our advantage, man. We get to uh, speak without compromise. Uh, we're not attached to certain uh, things. Uh, and another thing is just more about like like I said, making adjustments. Right. Um, it's not about I'm um, trying to be cheap. It's not right. that. It's just looking at the business models that do work. I don't really know how Planet Fitness and Netflix make all their money, but I know it's not off our subscriptions alone. Right? It's not off that alone, but if you look at the volume of subscriptions mm -hmm. that they do, that gives them a, a nice jump off to make things happen. And if you are a local artist mm -hmm. or even just, uh, let's say you, you have your own idea in your mind for a T-shirt, you mm -hmm. know what I mean, and you want to bring that to conception, they can come, they can visit you yeah. in in your workspace, and they can come in and they can make all of these things happen. And whether it comes to, you know, we need to Photoshop or Illustrate the project all the way down to marketing it and, and finishing it and producing it, Work Less Lifestyle is accommodated, making all of these resources available to the everyday person that's affordably. A that's a fact. And we actually, um, that's the long-term goal. Right now, it's, it's, I, I won't gas it because we're on the radio and say we're doing all that right now. The biggest thing that we offer right now is, like you said, custom apparel, uh, music studio recording, mm -hmm. and then photography uh, solutions, right? But my, the goal is to be able to offer those in a package. So when people come to the right. studio record, they're not paying $40, $50 an hour for their uh, session. It's more about like, oh, I'll see you on the first of the month for the last three times you just came to the studio. Right. right? So that's the final presentation. What I mean by like, I don't know how Netflix and Planet Fitness make their money is I know with mass comes attention. So then that's how you sell your marketing dollars for mm -hmm. the eyeball traffic. So that's how we, that's the deeper level of where we're going to go with less work. But to have an in-house solution, it, like I said, it's not based off necessity. This, this is survival. We don't really have somewhere we can go right now and have that offer. 
So where there's lack of, there's opportunity. And this is us embarking on an opportunity, right? So it's not a thing of existence now. But if you look at Madison, um, and this is my shout-out moment. If you look at Madison right now, you got uh, uh, organizations like uh, Chaos New Money. Mm -hmm. uh, AFGM. AFGM, right? They just opened up a studio. And everything you explained about less work is trickling down to, if you go to their studio, it's just like that. Right. It's, it's a recording studio. You just um, announced that they're doing a photography space in the inside. Mm -hmm. So this is the way. Yeah, he, he's created a one-stop shop similar, you know, to what you've already got going, but on a different, He's, you know, you guys have focused it. on different aspects. But it's the same. But, yeah, but absolutely. it's the same, right? Our door's open for the same people. It's not competition. It's, this is the way. This, this, because, okay, the reason why. That, but that makes sense, though. I yeah. mean, if you, it's, it's changing how you think to control your narrative, change that narrative. Big businesses deemed that your your subscription lifestyle is is how it's gonna come. And if yeah. you look now, shopping online, like everybody's like Afterpay and Shop Pay, like you know, like yeah. all these opportunities to to live outside of your means to make yourself more comfortable. That's a fact. And you know, like if you don't know what you're getting into, you're gonna spiral up. But if you know that you have people in your corner that like minded that are looking out for you, then you're gonna be able to control your narrative and, and turn your page the direction you need it to go. Facts. That, that's the biggest fact. See, the thing, the breakdown is this. You're not going to get paid off of music alone no. if you're an artist. We, we do run a business, but we are artists first that run the business. So these are also solutions to keep our revenue streams good, right? So you, we could do a million views and then the check won't be a million dollars, no. right? So it's more about understanding, like, how can I continue to make music from my heart without putting... Uh, a capital or a dollar amount on it to justify the times I've been in the studio, the hard times I got told no. It's like, nah, you turn your talent into a service. So if you house all these things under one roof, say like an AFGM or a Less Work or mm -hmm. Radio 22, whoever doing these type of solution-based offerings, this is the way. Because we're not just going to be in there recording rap songs. We're going to be doing voiceovers. We're going to be doing uh, community uh, uh, commercials. We're going we're gonna to be working with the community in a way where... The music will still be genuine, but we are a resource. We're not just right. rappers. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, that's the way I want to leave an imprint on this city. So it's like, what, what we do is less work. is just more about like resource, resource work. Um, and we partner with businesses. I think uh, one of the major areas that artists, businesses, whoever uh, get involved, the, the thing they go wrong with is waiting until they become someone of notoriety to do things to do something. based off of your leverage. Mm -hmm. It's like, see... Shout out my boy AG. Shout out Roy Jones. Like, I know the value they bring. These are, you know, the cameramen. I know the value they bring. So it's like when I go out and I speak on behalf of what I can do for less work, I got mm -hmm. them in mind. You know what I'm saying? Because right. they don't just work for me. We can be work able to make this, we can make this a, a thing where they may get work and I'm not even there. Right? But it's like that's still less work. Right? Absolutely. So it's like how can we branch off? How can we do these things together? Hip-hop is not a shared space. It's territorial. Over, over the history of it. It's a territorial yeah. space. It's us versus them. My, my, my Jones went number one. So it's like for me to come in and say, no, nah, that's not it. That's really breaking it all down. You really have to like um, unlearn to relearn. And everybody not going to be for that. That's, you know that's I mean? deep though. But as a whole in society is a bigger picture. I think that's a, a ticket that we need to take from too. It's true. It's true. I, and to be honest, man, like a lot of this stuff is synonymous. Like our solutions come from lived experience. You know, it's, it's not like I'm just a... Uh, I want rapper fame, because if you know me, I don't really care about the fame anyway. I, we do these things based off of survival mode. Like, nobody's going to come and save us. You know what I mean? But no. if you can offer something great enough for people to want to pay you and feel like, man, I, I feel like I got over on uh, Fusion, man. He gave me this for this price, and you know, I don't even think you know what he had, but you did. You created way more value than what the price was. Mm -hmm. So the customer is satisfied than having buyer's remorse. You know what I'm saying? Absolutely. So at the end of the day, it's just about that. Uh, let's work. We, we say... We the way because we understood the power of the internet. We understand the power of resources locally before we become this global figure. It's like right now, um, any anybody that's on our uh, basically our our list, um, uh, basically subscriptions. Whenever you shop with Less Work, you shopping with Madison. Mm -hmm. so it's a company in Madison. Because it's a collective, it's of, a collective of individuals and services that 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 turns into a thank you. You know what I mean? It's mm -hmm. like you didn't just purchase a shirt. You, you, you purchase your entry ticket to say, I'm a part of this lifestyle, right? And, and it won't stop with a purchase. It's like, we don't want to create like a one lane solution. We want to 
if, if you was to come in and bring your ideas, now we expand it, right? Because it's more hands, more brains. So it's a, it's a resource. If I had to explain what less work is at the end of the day, we just operate the space of hip hop. So let's talk some brass tacks here real quick. Is if people want to come and check you out, how's the best place to find you? Where you located at? Man, I would say 1444 East Washington, Madison, Wisconsin, uh, 53703. Um, right in the heart of downtown. Hard in the heart of it, man. We in, we in good space. It's over 20,000 cars dried out. used to wash every day, man. So you can't miss us. You got to see us. Uh, shout out um, uh, my boy Marcus Porter. They in there, too, in the same hub hey. as us. They are engineers. They uh, okay. support everybody in the city. Um, and then uh, also just uh, the RDN itself. If people are familiar with the RDN, the old space, the building, that's where we operate our hub at. Um, the goal is for us to be a solution for the city. Um, in the space of music, media, and uh, marketing. So if you're you know, looking at that, you know, you're continuing on that, who's the ideal customer for Work Less Lifestyle? Like, who who are you trying to reach? We Our, our main focus is local artists that rap um, because I feel like they don't know their potential, they don't know their leverage. Um, so we want to basically show them in action by doing what we do as mm -hmm. a template uh, to basically turn their talents into a service. Um, but I would say immediately success we have it is through uh, partnering with uh, local organizations in the city of Madison, um, doing like social media hosting, uh, screen printing apparel, and our bread and butter right now we are photography services ran by Kilo aka Skittle. Okay. So I would just say, man, like right now we. we but when we, you're building a brand, photography, video, uh, screen printing, you know, yeah. apparel design, those are all key things, especially this day and age. That you're going to need to carry a brand, yeah. uh, as again, performance is not going to pay an artist's salary. Merchandising and, and touring is what's going to bring a majority of, of that income. You know, you'll make something on royalties and rights if you blow up, mm -hmm. but until you reach a certain point, like the, that's just a dream that's a fact. That, that's kind of waved out in front of your face there. You know, and it's it's you know, yeah. it's it's really about looking at the the industry that we operate in. Like if it's whatever industry we do, ours in, in entertainment, right, and which happens to fall under music. So, I can write the song. I still need to record the song. The world want to hear the song, so now I need to shoot a video. Now I need promo because people are going to be asking for press releases. So I need some high quality images. Mm -hmm. So, I'm just blessed to be in a situation where we got those things as a resource under the roof. But now we can um, contract them out. So it's not always for me. You know what I mean? So like that's where the bread and butter comes from. And the opportunities are endless, man. It really is, bro. Like people be like, man, like if you put have this focus on like the other things that you do, they probably a blow. You know what I mean? Like and, and they have specific reasons. And it's like I see that, but the the, the the demand for I guess my presence in certain different areas, I gotta spread. You know what I'm saying? Like I, 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 I focus on like what I focus on, but I gotta spread. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm I don't have a one track uh focus for just doing music or just doing clothes. I wanna be a resource. You wanna be a community resource. I wanna be a resource. All right, so I, I want to ask, you know, I got another question I want to kind of tie back into this. We're doing cultural and community awareness here, February, Black History Month. For you, Bran, what does being a small local business owner mean? Like, what does that mean to you? Creative control. Um, I get to write it down. I get to execute it in a way where I see it. Um, it means I get to rewrite the rules. Um, it means I get to do it my way. Um, and it's not all, like, you know, ego at all. It's just more about, like, seeing it for... What it is, it's like as a small business, there's things like taxes, <laughs> there's things like uh, uh, overhead, it's things like outside of like the glitz and glamour of it. So don't get me wrong, like it's not like something I'm encouraging everybody to do, um, but it's just more about if you're not going to settle for the traditional way of income, right? You want to do it this way. Absolutely. Hey, work less lifestyle. It ain't, it ain't just a business; it's a lifestyle. It really is. Man, uh, one more time. What's the website if anybody wants to tap in? So yeah, you go uh, Google Less Work Local Lifestyle. Uh, we everywhere: website, um, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram. Uh, so I would just type us in, uh, Less Work Local Lifestyle. I think that's um, what's up. What I will say about the lifestyle is this: um, mm -hmm. the reasons why we do music, the reasons why we do media, and the reasons why we do photography is because these are all aspects of the lifestyle that we represent. So let's work local lifestyle. So when you look into the lifestyle, you see let's work lens, mm -hmm. you see let's work literature, and you see let's work lyrics. These are the pillars that embody the local lifestyle of let's work. Uh, so I just wanted to uh, make that part clear. Our areas of focus is local artists that rap, uh, local businesses that partner with us, uh, because uh, again, there's no profession that's more, uh, I would say, influential than a rapper. 
Uh, it could be Kanye West, whoever artist, whatever platform you want to talk about. But there's no one, to me, in my opinion, uh, more influential than a rapper. Uh, so my thing is localizing global solutions under one roof um, and, and spreading them out. Uh, local is the new global because of tools like the internet and uh, opportunities. That's, like that's real, though. That's you know real, man. Local is the new global. It is. It is. Uh, yeah. So again, man, thank you, Fusion, for even you know, giving me this, this platform to speak, um, to just talk about less work. A lot of people uh, aren't aware of what we do. And like I was just telling our team that uh, these are the opportunities we need to jump at to be able to just connect with different people who immediately would understand what we're doing and then support us too. So I appreciate you. Man, uh, right now I, I hope there's eighty to 100,000 people in Madtown listening into this and getting ready to adjust to a, a less work lifestyle with you. So uh, Brian, uh, a.k.a. one of many, I appreciate you. And y'all need to check out a less work lifestyle. That's a fact. Just because we don't hear, I got to correct Fusion. He just said it like 10 times. The company is less work, local lifestyle. But that's real love, though. I appreciate you. <laughs> we get, we'll I'm going to give you a pass because he got the shirt on, too. So I know you're he, he repping us. Okay, well, we'll get it. We'll get it right here eventually. Uh, you know, Black History Month, it's, it's huge. This is a big part of the year. But right now, we're also trying to put an impact on local black owned businesses. So please keep doing you. Please put out for our community. And please keep putting out for hip hop. That's a fact. We'll do, man. Yeah. All right, man. Appreciate y'all. Uh, thanks for listening. Thanks for having us. Uh, hey, uh, one of on all platforms. That's the, the ad symbol, the number one, N E O F M A N R. So that's real love. Shout out. Shout out Fusion. Shout out 93.1. Man, shout out Madison. I don't know if y'all know, but we coming. It's a beautiful city. city. It's a hub right now, boy. We made a lane. I want it low. You want it fame. Protecting my energy. I won't be drained. We not in synergy. We not the same. All of my enemies know me by name. If Kilo ain't killing them, I want the blame. Buy, buy, build, renovate your land. Motivate your people. Tap them in. More to make the profits in the plan. Who fake focus on your fans Write it down, pray for what you win Hope it's more than making less to spend Late for what it's worth, I came to win Leaving how I came with less friends